Stop. Why did it get dark? Hey internet, it's Jessica and welcome to Answer Not. Please excuse my voice because after E3 I caught a cold even though I wasn't physically at E3, but hey, it just got me. Anyway, this is a game that I found browsing on Steam. Um, it's about a guy, I think his name is Zachary, and he's at home, home alone right now, and some like weird stuff is happening to him, and we're gonna have to discover what that weird stuff is. And uh, other than that, I have no context if it's like spooky, or if it's like heartwarming, or anything like that, but it really piqued my interest because I played a lot of games that are similar to like this, so hopefully we will enjoy it. Anyway, before we get started, if you guys would like to get the game yourself, I'll leave a link in the description. It is actually free to play, so you can play it yourself if you would like. And I'll leave a link to all the developer stuff too if you want to check them out. Alright, let's play. Oh, hey, dear. <laughs> okay, I wasn't calling for anything in particular, I just wanted to talk to you. Okay. It's not that I'm bored or anything, not at all. Tuesdays are always a lot of fun. And Stacy got that right. Fucking Stacy. God, fucking Stacy. <laughs> World's best Anyhow. husband. Yeah, don't forget to book this year's destination, okay? Since you're not over busy working from home. No, mister, you're not fooling me. I know you didn't forget about it. Yep, I saw the catalogs on the table, Zach. Learn to hide your evidence, sweetheart. So I, I guess he was planning a vacation? Messages, but come on. Sometimes I just dream of you answering the phone so I don't feel like a crazy person talking to herself all the time. Shit. Jeff's coming. Okay, talk to you later. Love you. Okay, bye. So, either that's our wife or that's our girlfriend or something. Oh dear, okay. Um... This is very pretty. Okay, so I guess I'll just take a look around if I can pick up anything. Uh, that's a doggo. Whoa, what is up with these settings to walk? It's kind of weird. Um... I guess the camera has like a little bit of shake, right? Interact, left click. Can I click anything? Can I click this? No. Um, there has to be something I can click. Can I drink the coffee? <laughs> That'd be like a start. Uh. Oh hey, dear. Sorry. Jesus Christ. I stuck again. Because of Stacy and her great habit of leaving work early. Yeah. Where's the phone? As usual. You know, this time I had to proofread our whole paper before I went into print. Anyway, I'll be home in about an hour. Hey, could you please get the chicken out of the freezer for tonight? Oh, okay. Thanks. See you in a bit. All right, see ya. Love you. Love you too. What is this? Uh, the cake is a lie. Oh, that's a reference. <laughs> um, you're a monster. Okay, I have to get the f fridge. All right, open this. Is this the chicken takeout? Okay. Oh. Zach, do you need anything from the drugstore? I just the time just changed. I'm looking at the spheres right now. Uh, well, if you could answer the phone, it might make things easier for me. But yeah. Can I pick it up? Back. Click me if you want some. I can't pick oh, it up because there's no like icon to say I can pick it up. You make me buy new ones, okay. Love you. See ya. Okay. See ya. Um. See what else we have. Can you do three covers today, please? Uh, any idea who sent this? Okay, um. Oh. Okay, a White Run Stables. Established in 1826, the White Run Stables has been running the family ever since. It is now famous for unforgettable trails in Oregon, higher mountains. Oregon! Of course! Every game that I play that something weird happens, it's always in Oregon. Uh, you won't believe our horses can go this way, and yet they can. Every day, book a Monday, book a tour. So I guess we have to book the vacation there? Probably? I don't know. Um. Uh, they can't get my name right. Invitation, Zach Irvine. Uh, after the world-famous Babyface, the visionary painter unveils new inheritance. And it's like, splashed out. So are we an artist? Shopping list. Okay, computer tower, PlayStation 1, guitar, three or four pairs of shoes, coat, coat hangers, backpacks, desk furniture, scissors, tape, erasers, random books, first floor jackets. What the hell? Why do we need all this stuff? Um, okay, let's see what else we can look at. Oh, what's that? Oh! Hey! This is an easter egg to another game that I played! Um, I forgot what it's called, but I'll put on the screen the name. I know that. They, I know the developers are friends, so that is an easter egg right there. That's pretty cool. Uh, 
Some pictures, okay. Alright. Um... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Maybe I go to my computer? Oh, here we go. It's working now. Your PC broke again, right? You should ask my friend Kenny. He's like, uh, Charlie. He'll totally fix it up in no time. I'll call him for you if the phone really is the problem. Um... So we can't even work? Can't drink my damn coffee? Uh... Okay, let's see. Giant, gorgeous village hanging on the rocks above a Mediterranean sea. An old shell collector told me the name of the place meant giant squid, and it's really weird. I cannot pronounce that. I don't want to, uh, you know, butcher it. Booze Lagoon. Uh, absolutely cannot. Uh, I can't remember if that June or me. The guide, maybe? Switzerland. So, I guess, like, they, they go traveling, too, right? I guess. Um, June's little brother. The little, uh... Pratt is still doing wonderfully in the Korean. She is so unbarely proud. Uh, Geneva Lake helps a lot of relieving tensions and forgetting the dumb one. Bright side, Calvin came along in meeting. I'll cherish forever in my head and keep this notebook. The day the brothers met. Okay. To-do list. Finish the uh, Vietnam report. Finish the moon board for the DBS magazine project. Cook a real meal. For real? Uh, 20 minute guitar, clean desk, or not. Or yes, cookies, electric bill, change the hard drive, water the plant, don't let them die, lol, laundry, goddammit. Okay, I guess that's stuff for us to do, right? Bonjour, les amis. We made it to Paris, and here's not a second we spent without thinking about you guys. We found a marvelous SPA, or spa, uh, a few days ago that we've spent the entire afternoon since Aiden is so relaxed and now he can't feel his body anymore. Have an awesome normal day back at home, Jody and Aiden Holmes. Oh, Jody and Aiden actually, because remember, this is a reference to Beyond Two Souls. Jody is the girl that we play, and Aiden is her brother. <laughs> That's so cool. Everyday Heroes. Photo Contest is a, a reference to Life is Strange. Oh my god, there's so many references to a lot of games in here. That's cool. The only day he loves me more than me. Okay. It's a bike. Uh, can we look at anything else? Can, I gotta water this plant. Is it dead already? Okay, uh, what did he say? Play guitar or something like that? Has to be something else I can do. Um, I, oh, it's just essentially like me looking through stuff. The way that it looks, it looks like how the pictures did in Life is Strange. I think that's really cool. It's stylized that way. Um, let's see if there's like anything else. There has to be like a guitar or something around here. Brave New World, I told you. Alright. Um, the Morning by Cassandra Troy, based on future events. You're going to be the first one. Reminder, please uh, re read these manuscripts to help your sweetheart. Okay, so our wife, girlfriend, whatever, she's a writer? I'm assuming, right? I'm assuming that's us, probably, right? Hey, we're good, we're good looking. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, uh... What's this? Okay, um, what does that say? Treat Stacy wrote this. Well, Stacy's a bitch, remember, so I don't know. Uh, coming soon. The hell does that mean? Oh. Third. First, second, third. Bang, bang! My baby shot me down. That's, um, what's her name? Nancy Sinatra song. Mind control facilitate, okay. Travel notebook. Uh, 2000, Scotland, 2002, Indonesia, 2003, Nepal. Note to sell, buy new notebook. Nepal, uh, June 24, 2003. Weirdest thing happened today. We, tr we tried to go to the first uh, Shambhala wood sack, as Chloe recommended lately. Sorry, the writing is a little bit hard for me to read, but turns out half the temples are gone, blown up. According to the locals, some bizarre treasure hunter came over and his team and suddenly gunfire rockets and the helicopters even now were welcome to visit the ruins and ashes. This is not the kind of trip Zach and I were expecting, really. I can't help but ponder. What, re they really... something. Okay. Nepal. Is that supposed to be a reference to, like, Uncharted or something? Because, <laughs> you know, he blew up a lot of stuff, uh, freaking Nathan Drake. Do we have enough? S slept at night. I was about to ask if that was a dildo, that was a candle, my bad. Ah! Uh, <laughs> uh, PlayStation games, okay. 
I still don't know where the guitar is at, so I, I don't think I, it's anything over here. Can I look at anything on the desk? Oh. Doggo! <gasps> Ooh, someone's getting a tattoo or painted on. Uh, there's a Chloe tattoo from Life is Strange. Dear Esther, thank you for the pictures. I, Oregon. Okay. Let's see. Okay, what's this? Okay, he spit up his drink, I guess. Mind-blowingly funny. Um, oh. Hypnotism. Calvin gave this for you yesterday as a warning. He's all into sleepwalking because the mind-blocking powers against evil forces now. His latest theory is that you'll end up a brainless puppet that follows everything I say if I keep talking to you in your sleep. Next time we visit, give your brother a hug and tell him I love him, will you? He's already growing to dislike me, and please don't read this bullshit. So he's having trouble sleeping. He's like sleepwalking, I guess. Okay. Adventure time book tour now. So here's another thing we could do with our wife, uh, if we get a chance. Scrambled eggs queen. Okay. There's a chicken. Is it just gonna hang out there? New shoes. Postcard. That's a spa. I mean, maybe we could book that. I don't know. Can we open any of this? Admire someone else's beauty without questioning your own. Okay. Wake up. Is that a Matrix th reference? What is that? Okay, I think uh, I got everything in the clear now. Okay, we gotta check if there's beer in the fridge. I'm assuming it, 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 this is the only fridge we have, right? I, I don't, I don't really know. Let's uh, we got soda, Coca-Cola. Uh, that's kind of it, right? We don't have anything. Can we tell her that or something like that? I don't know. I, I don't know if there's like any other like because some, some people have like a beer fridge, you know. So I don't know if that's like a thing. Ooh, there's a safe in here. I don't know the number, though. I change it. You will have to use your brain a little now. Hint. W what does the gun say? What? What does that mean? Okay. Um, can I go upstairs? Oh, the laundry's blocking the way. I can't go upstairs. I fell down the stairs, too. There has to be, like, something I can trigger another phone call. I looked at the fridge. There's nothing in there. Oh, here we go. There we go. It's, I knew it. Is it getting darker or is it me? Uh, another shitty day, yeah. Traffic at almost 8 p.m. What the fuck, right? That definitely makes me want to be on a motorcycle right now. And yeah, I know. You're always right, I know. But you don't need to get out all the motorcycle ads before I arrive, you know? I'm not gonna buy one today. Okay. Don't get too bored while waiting for your dear wife to call home. She's our wife. Love you. Okay, I look at the motorcycle stuff. But yeah, it looks like the sun is setting. Like how how what is time right now? Uh here we go. Best price. This one. Uh sure, I guess. I don't know. We took it out. Hey. It's odd. I'm I'm still stuck in this thing with traffic jam. What? Cars are barely moving one inch an hour. First, I thought it was an accident, but it looks like cops are inspecting the cars as if they were looking for something. I wonder what's going on. Uh. Have, have you heard anything about a terrorist attack? What? Like, on the radio or the paper? I really hope not. Okay, that's that's our cue to turn on the radio or something. Okay, 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 let's go to the radio. I saw one here over, yeah, this corner. Terrorist attack. Breaking news. If you're planning on going in and out of the City of Roses, you'll have to be patient. Unexpected traffic jams have paralyzed the city of Portland. Many people are still trying to get home as we speak. The cause is still unknown, but Helen, I'm sure, is just another poor dog locked in a car. More on that later, but now, here's some jazz. Oh, okay. Like, that's supposed to make it better? Uh, I saw a newspaper here earlier, too. Hang on. Okay, there's a paper by the door. That must be it. 
Wa Wyoming on fire. Destructive fire gaining ground in Wyoming. A new archaeological discovery in Kenya. The archaeology team discovered by Professor Jean Raymond in Kenya discovered this week's new specimen of dinosaur presumed to be dated from the pa uh, pa Paleolithic sorry, age. The bones are structured specimen in great shape, almost intact, declared by uh, P.R. Raymond. Uh, it's really difficult to date this discovery since it's a whole new species discovered here. Firemen are up against the worst fire in the decade. Scandal in the scientific community. United Kingdom could possibly be an alien life finally in What is up with going on in the world? What the hell? They morph? They slowly morph? What does that mean? Um, the subject of light liquid, a scientific paper in the heart of a scandal, the debacle is shaking the scientific community in Europe, is getting more attention than NASA and CDC have an eye on it. British astronaut Dr. Brennan, working ahead of a scientific section of the London Middlesex University, is the heart of the hurricane and the revealing his latest research paper. Colleagues are all over the country questioning potential discovery, even raising suspicion over the mental health and yet very uh, rece respected professor, according blank. Uh, even states a potential threat an alien could represent. NASA has yet to release a commutative uh, press and made sure to re something population by threat has been made. Dangerous psychiatric pa patient escaped and scares the drivers in Route 22. What the hell is going on? Portland around 3 p.m. on Sunday, drivers on their way to Portland through the Route 26 got a big scare. Uh, indeed, a man described as extremely tall and barely clothed oh, started walking on the busy driveway of a car drove by him. Witnesses say that he stood in the middle of the road and tried to follow the cars. When we passed it by, uh, he stared at us with a strange look in his face. Other reports say that the man tried to jump onto the car and attack them. Mostly stay simply observed by the man and, and described him as a disoriented standing on the side of the road. Authorities didn't take long to take a deranged man into care and remove him from the area. The police liaison David Dupin revealed that the man was a patient in the Newmark psychiatric ward that escaped earlier that day. Authorities have not yet revealed the identity of the patient, but claimed the situation was under control and that the man was not a danger to the population anymore. Newmark Hospital failed to provide any new information or comment on the case and is remaining silent. It was all fear than harm done. But how is this like happening right now if we just like found out about it? Like what time zone are we in? You know what I mean? Like why is time so weird right now? Okay, I'll take it, I guess. Hey, Zach, it's me again. Hey. You won't believe it. A cop made us all get out of our cars, and, and now we're all waiting for a bus? No explanation? I, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I, I had to leave all my work in the car. Like, how am I gonna get it back? What is going on? Something's really out of order tonight. Not to mention, you're not answering the frigging phone, and it's really frustrating. What are you even doing? Did you get all the messages? If you're falling asleep, I will find out, you know. You always make such a mess on the couch and you never clean up and I... Oh. Wait. A bus has arrived. Wait. Uh... Okay. I I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get it on the bus. Okay, I'll, I'll call you back. What is happening? Okay, so she mentioned work and cleaning up the couch. Uh, can I clean up? Yeah, I can clean up the couch. Um What's the point of having a phone if you don't answer it? Ugh. Sleep at night, mister. Anyhow, I'm on the bus. It's supposed to take us out of the city. I, I don't know exactly where they'll drop us, but I'll manage to find a way home. Okay. I think they got this under control. Is it like the apocalypse? Like what's going on? Someone said he heard that strange things happen all over town. Did you hear anything back home? Is everything like normal? Um. I don't want to sound alarming, but you still have the gun somewhere, right? Gun? It's still loaded, isn't it? Gun? I, I have absolutely no idea what it could be. We have a gun? I've seen strange people standing on the side of the road, like they popped out of nowhere and. Please call me if you hear or see anything, or even just to let me know you're not dead, please. Okay, gun. See if we have to find it somewhere. Oh, I think I know where the gun is. It's in the safe, isn't it? Yeah. Oh god, I don't know what the code is. 
Okay. She said, what does the gun say? There's the Nancy Sinatra, like, song. Bang, bang, my baby shot me down. So, first, second, fourth, and then third. Okay. There's the gun! I'm scared. What's gonna happen? I'm actually scared something's gonna happen. The boss dropped us somewhere near Pinwheel Street and they told me a shuttle to Candle Santa would come any minute. I'm almost there, okay? Uh, an old guy said that aliens have come. That's what we're facing. That they're everywhere and God, that doesn't make sense. Is that what I hear? Aliens? Come on. He said crazy things and he had like a panic attack, so some cops had to calm him down and well, listen. According to a security guard, the shuttle will drop me in our street at 10 sharp. Please make sure you're here at 10 o'clock, Zach, okay? Please, keep an eye on the clock and don't let me down. What would aliens even look like? That's, that's insane. Just, just call me back, please. 10 o'clock? Okay, so we gotta, like, I guess look at the clock? Because she said, keep an eye out for me and then don't let me down. Where the frick's the clock? Uh, what is up with that footstep noise? Like, what is that? That's why it's freaking me out. Okay, uh, 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock. Do we have a clock here? Okay, I have a question. Is it me or does this door look like it's, like, open? Like, it's not closed? That's why it's freaking me out. That's why I keep thinking there's something in here. Yo, where's your clock? <laughs> oh, here it is. I'm scared. I'm my voice down because everyone's so tense. Oh, I can't wait for this night to end. Please, Zach. Wake up and call me back, please. I really need to hear your voice right now. I don't know what led to this strange creature's bullshit, but please lock everything up, okay? And stay inside. Lock up the windows, too. Stay inside until I come back, okay? Okay. Don't let anything come in. What if it's already in here? That's what I'm scared of! Okay, so I have to lock up everything. Okay, lock up. Lock up. Damn, how many windows are you opening? Oh! What was that? Bitch, what the fuck was that? Like that, I don't like that. That was just me, right? That was just me. That was just me. Right? That was just me. Okay. That's just me! Oh my god, this is freaking me out. <laughs> I don't like that! I thought this was supposed to be a wholesome game, not some freaking horror shit! The fuck? Did I lock up everything? I think the front door is the only one, right? What? What? Come, come and get me, please. They're, they're here. It, it's real. It's real. They're it's all set. Please come and get me. Because I'm really scared. I'm afraid. Ooh. No, 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 no. Stop. Why did it get dark? Bitch. Bitch. No. I thought this was wholesome. What is happening? Why? alien the entire time what the fuck was what did i just play what did i just play that freaked me out whoa whoa <laughs> what 
Whoa. It's either that or Zack was the alien the entire time. <laughs> oh my god. That scared me. Yo, this is a good game. Wow, okay. Uh maybe that's why he 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 couldn't sleep at night, right? Like he he, he the reason why he can't sleep is because he's a freaking alien or something like that. I don't know. That freaked me out though, the ending. What was that? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well, that's gonna be the end of this let's play. I, I wanna say, I know a lot of people, you know, give shit for like walking simulators, but I think they're very intriguing. Games like this are very intriguing to me because there's there's they write good stories behind it. So I really enjoy it. That just creeped me out. Um, anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like, let me know in the comments what you think, and if you want to play the game yourself, uh, I'll leave a link in the description as well. Uh, maybe that explains why that creepy noise, like, I heard, like, throughout the game, like, that creepy walking noise? That's probably him. Ugh. Ugh. Anyway, uh, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button for more, uh, videos, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!